I could maybe get a point of spirit up now. Two points. Because I have one hit from here, from the belt, and 1% hit from the tube set that I have. So I have 2% hit and two more from shadow focus. It's going to be four for shadow spells. And we need three in PvP. Classic 3% hit. Or maybe to fully try it, I could put more now because I used to take improved mind blast. So I could just put four points now. So now I'm going to be trying spirit tap four points on it. It would it should proc most of the time. Should proc on almost every kill. And with that, I'll try out this spec. A little spec update, I guess, now that I have a lot of uh, big upgrades from Gnomergan. And gear update too. I have this epic helm from Tailoring Crafted. This uh, Gnomer neck. Shoulders can be better. There is Gnomer shoulders as well from the raid with stamina, spell power and intellect. Very good. This uh, from the STV event. This is from the set from Gnomer with the tokens. Warson Gouge Exalted. Weapons from BFD still. I need Epic Dagger and there is a BOE offhand with stamina and shadow spell power. Little spell power offhand. Oh, I mean wand. This trinket. I also have the BFD spell power trinket. So intellect. Signia. And uh, stamina. And armor ring. This epic ring. This uh, revered reputation with AB boots with the run speed and stamina enchant this one from the set this six stamina hit spell power and these gloves from gnomer as well most of my gear is now level 40 updated to level 40 from gnomer just need better weapons and i'm looking very good so unbuffed i'm at 2037 hp nice 2k hp unbuffed in pvp and my spell power uh let's bring the calculator 12 and 9 168 spell power total 168 that's a lot that should be big damage to people in pvp and uh, the runes i just come from raid so i have that one the runes obviously are shadow or death mind spike humunculi dispersion and void plague in pvp He has a lot of HP or he's tanky. I can dispel this. Oh fuck! He dies, he dies! Before me! <laughs> okay, I got him. I did him and got him. Fucking goblin. I'll farm the gold. Any blackouts here? Okay, he interrupted this. I was waiting for the interrupt. That's why I was casting specifically my place. Finally a blackout, it exists. That warrior survived for so long, man. Probably the warrior surviving me the longest. This boomy really, really wants to kill me.
Don't break the feet. Oh. oh my god, nice fear. Oh, that was clutch fear from my guy. Nice. Look at how clutch the score is too. This is potentially like the most important cup. Because if we hold now, we're gonna win. Need to hold three bases. The fight is not over yet. Is there any casters I need to silence? Blackout stun? Yeah, silence this caster. Spurs on this guy. Should have shielded my warrior earlier. If I can survive until we cap at least, it would be good. Nice, we just capped. So my graveyard is here now. I can res on my corpse now. Because he didn't loot me. Then we nuke this guy. And then the warrior. Silence this priest. Healing the warrior. Kill the warrior. Kill this mage. I die it's okay it's even okay even better because i can rest with full mana and we pretty much handled the base clutchnessness what the fuck man am i stuck how do i get stuck here what is what is this bro male night elf dude i'm literally stuck look i can't <laughs> I, <laughs> i'm stuck at the door i'm too big i'm actually stuck i'm not stuck it was levitate <laughs> i was levitated <laughs> I had levi levitate on. <laughs> uh, I was I trolled myself. I debated myself. <laughs>